Hey, welcome to Steam Culture. I'm Brent, this is Gail Borden, and this is Borden's Condensed Milk. Stay tuned, and I'm going to tell you the story of how these two things came together. Well, Gail Borden was an American inventor, and as history tells the story, he was returning from London where he was at the 1851 World's Fair where he won an award for the meat biscuit. Doesn't that sound yummy? Well, on the way back, he watched several passengers become ill and die from the effects of contaminated milk. And right there and there in that moment, he became passionate about creating a safe way for milk to be uh, extracted and preserved. See, at the time, Milk pretty much had to be taken from the cow and consumed right away. And even then, there weren't very sanitary methods for getting the milk out. Now, he was inspired by a process of evaporation that he had seen the shakers used as they extracted juice from vegetables and fruit, and they extracted it down and made concentrates and sugars and different things like that. So with that in mind, he created a special vacuum evaporator that used steam as the heating source. Now, after the milk comes through the evaporation process, you're left with evaporated milk. A lot of us also know it as sweetened condensed milk, and the only difference is that condensed milk has sugar added to it. Roughly 60% of the liquid, or the water, is taken out of milk, and you get this thick syrup. And what Borden really left us with is a shelf-stable product that lasts for years that is also free of contaminants because of the vacuum process that he created. He actually also ended up with a nice company with his, with his name on it, nice little feature there. But Gail Borden made a significant impact to history using steam and we wanted to tell you about it. So when you're eating those bars at Christmas time that people make or Vietnamese coffee, if you ever had that with condensed milk, you can thank Gail Borden. Well, I'm thanking you for joining us, but you can thank yourself by Googling us because we have content each and every week to help to make you a better person. You can watch a Boiling Point as well, learn a lot of things. You can share and subscribe if you would. We would appreciate it very much. I'll see you next Friday.